Why is this Hanabi and Ministry of Health scam bad for us, bad for our people? It is bad because it's taking away resources that are meant to purchase appropriate protective equipment, protective gear for our health staff that are meant to buy medicines that will heal people, not expired medicines. And really, taking away resources through this corruption, this greed that we've seen over years, money that is meant to even support the procurement of vaccines, the coronavirus vaccine, which is not going to be possible with such money as stolen. It means that now this corruption through honeybee contract, through the Ministry of Health, is contributing to the deaths of our people. And this is unacceptable. We should put a stop to it together as people. Things that are wrong are wrong, and we must not allow these things to happen because we know the consequences of that. It was planned that I go to attend the funeral of uh, our late uh, youth chairman, uh, Ronald Warrior Manenga, who died in a road uh, traffic accident together. He was with other people. Some are still in hospital, others have been discharged. So my mission was to go and pay my last respect, join others in mourning Manenga, and thereafter, just visit the sick in hospital, visit the homes of those who have been discharged, which is normal. This is how we do it, and it's, it's a practice. It's a habit. And imagine, I want Zambians to imagine that I decided to fly there. The choice is mine. I could have driven. I could have flown. I decided to fly. And the PF government instructed National Air Force Authority, Civil Aviation, and other related organs to cancel all flights, basically shutting out the airspace on the copy branch, just to stop one individual, one citizen called Hakaini Ishilemi, from mourning his friend, a dedicated member, a strong leader of our youth movement, a very innovative young man, and still a young man, meaning that he had a young wife, he had a young, he had young children. And it was, it was the right thing for me to do, to attend that party, that I was close. It's a really acceptable situation. It's an African, it's inhuman to stop colleagues from mourning each other. By the way, later on in the day, we realized that it wasn't just the airspace that shut out. They had also blocked roads into the corporate. They had physically blocked South Dams and other airports, including private airstrips they were instructed not to accept me to land on those airstrips. I have never understood how the whole government machinery at a huge expense can be abused in this way, can take away citizens' right to mourn each other, citizens' right to travel, to move, to assemble, to associate. This is unheard of. This is taking into a level which is too far. The resources that were wasted on this mission could have been used to buy effective drugs, not expired drugs. 